Alex Cabanel was a famous painter born in France. He was born on the 20th day of September in the year of 1889. He was really famous for having both the religious and classical form of expression. Some believe that his artwork gave his audience an, a sense of an aristocratic allure, while others thought that his form of expression and artwork was full of vulgarity. Moses was one of Jesus' most faithful and precious disciples during the biblical times. God mentioned to him in De Deuteronomy that he was to die and that his kids would have his land. And so this artwork by Cabanel depicts his death. Another beautiful artwork that he created is known as the Nymph and the Satire in the year of 1860. There are only pr private collections of this art. This artwork has a satire, which is a demon, which is the offspring of both an animal and a human. The demon in this picture seems to be holding the nymph in his hand. The nymph is a goddess who opposes with rivers, springs, mountains, or any type of natural life form. They are usually very loving and supportive. They were first mentioned by the Greeks after the multitution of the Oranos. Last but not least, we have the, the picture of the birth of Venus, which was painted in the year of 1863. Cabanel was 43 when he painted this picture. It's a picture of a nude woman with angels flying over her. They look to be playing music of the heavens with trumpets in their hands made out of seashells. If you want to see this artwork, you would have to visit Paris to see it. The Aphrodite goddess was known to be very beautiful and was carried across by sea with the clamshell.